Oh. You didn't expect an opening cutscene. Okay, that looked a bit like opening cutscenes from PS1 era, which this game takes much influence from. Hello, everybody, the time of the game we're playing indie horror games, and they were playing Death Laundry, Laundry the demo for Death Laundry by Ragalao, version 1.5. You're a delivery man who, after waking up from a strange nightmare, gets up in front of a laundry where you hardly know what awaits you. Okay. PS1 style sound effects, dialogue, new dialogue system, cutscenes, places. Okay, okay, let's just dive in and see what happens. Noah, delivery man. Wesley. Who is Noah and who is Wesley and who are we? Hey, bro, wake up. Yes, I am awake. And who are you? Dude, I know you're sleeping, but can you give me a coin? No. I'm starving. I want to buy at least one snack. All right, bro, here's some coins. Thank you, friend. I wish you all the best. Um, I'm about to die, I guess, so would you kindly stick around and die for me instead? No? Okay. We're in this together. That's pretty much what I said. And you know, there are rumors that a mannequin is kidnapping people that night in this neighborhood. If you see him, hide immediately. They say he lives in that cabin with a strange creature, but the police have been there and they said there was no one. The worst thing is that I'm going to start my shift to deliver some boxes of soap to the laundry. Don't worry so much, there's a police patrolling nearby, but still keep an eye out. Okay, see ya. See ya. I finally finished delivering the cartons of body wash to the laundromat. Okay, so what are we supposed to do now? I just need to go to the bathroom and then I can go home. Looks like there's no one on the side of that hut over there. Dude... Come on, just go behind the laundromat and relieve yourself. I guess that would be unprofessional, sure, but... Monsters around, you know? Screw that. I ain't dying for nobody. Emo moment. Sure, why not? This is where the world ends. And this is where the other side of the world ends. And I'm guessing this will be the third side where the world ends. This is an outhouse. Some strange noises are coming from that house. Okay, cannot interact with this. Weird. Okay. Should we go and knock on the door? Arg. Okay then. The graphics got a bit stretchy here, but I'm guessing that's what happens when you try to emulate PS1 era graphics. That's how graphics were back then. Not much I can do, though. Yeah, some strange noises are coming from the house, but I can't enter it. Can we just enter our truck and leave? In a moment, can you help me? Oh. Oh, hello! 14 minutes later. Matthew, police. Okay, then. Oh, was this graffiti here before? You can't use a gun also, it's a huge gun. Full version of the game in September. Oh, come on. End of demo version 1.5. Maybe I missed a couple of things, but all in all, that was the demo for Death Laundry by Regalao. Okay, credits roll. Fantastic. It's interesting. I've said many times that I like the PS1 era aesthetic, it just speaks to me. Sound design was good, the premise is interesting, but uh, I don't know where this is going. But sure, it seems like something good can come out of it. Keep working on this. Everybody, go to the link down in the description below, download this game, try it out for yourselves, help indie developers get the games out there. I will see you all in the next one. Until then, stay safe and have fun.